On Monday, opened a new, safer and more convenient route for Indians undertaking the arduous Kailash Mansarovar Yatra as the first batch of pilgrims crossed the Indian border and entered Tibet via Nathula in the latest confidence-building measure between the two neighbours. A total of 43 Indian pilgrims went through the second land crossing in Tibet, the new route in addition to the existing Lipulek Pass and the only route earlier that was damaged in the Uttarakhand floods in 2013. Over half a century after it was closed following the 1962 Sino-India War, the Chinese ambassador to India received the first batch of Indian pilgrims to the Kailash Mansrova Yatra in Tibet on Monday, marking the opening of a new route through the Nathula Pass in Sikkim. The Chinese ambassador said preparations have been made for the comfortable stay of pilgrims. Roads have been repaired. All arrangements are in place for the pilgrimage. The Chinese ambassador, who himself crossed over to Tibet through the Nathula Pass on Sunday, received 43 Indian pilgrims, including BJP MP Tarun Vijay and his wife, on Monday morning. The new route to the Himalayan Pass will facilitate more comfortable travel for Indian pilgrims, especially the elderly, by buses compared to the existing route via the Lipulekh Pass in Uttarakhand. This batch will complete the Mansrova Parikarma on June 27th and the Kailash Parikarma on June 28th before returning to Indian side on the 3rd of July. The journey will be mainly covered through bus with only a little stretch of trekking. Kailash Mansrova is believed to be the seat of Lord Shiv. Hundreds go on the pilgrimage every year with a part of the journey overseen by Chinese authorities. Bureau Report, DD News.